yo, what up? Just came from the game. Same, same results all the time. You know what I'm saying? So, um, I, I'm, I'm going to say this. I got to start being happy with me. I'm not going to let my path cross paths with other people ever again. Other people have no understanding of what love is, no understanding of what friendship is, no understanding of what loyalty is, no understanding of what, just the simple things. And when you're dealing with people in your life, friends, family, relationships, etc., you have to start being like, if I continue to do this and I'm getting these kind of results from this, I'm going to go ahead and let that shit go. You have to understand, like, people will say shit to you and expect you to just forget about it. And then they want to laugh it off. Well, it's funny till it's not funny. Right? So now I'm, I'm on a different vibe. I'm going to start taking more trips, like maybe once a month. More trips out of town. I'm not going to post it and all that shit. I'm just going to leave town. And I'm going to go enjoy life. Because I realize in my life, I've had, like people say, man, Carter, why you ain't got, why you ain't got, you know, why you ain't been married and all, why you ain't married and all that. I'm going to tell you why. Because you have to know that the person that you're with is going to ride or die for you until the end. You got to know that they're going to have your back no matter what. You got to know that shit. You got to know they won't crack under pressure. You got to know that. You got to know that. Like, they they got you when the time comes. A lot of times, like, we don't get that from a person. You know what I'm saying? I feel like in my life that I probably had maybe, honestly, two people in my lifetime that would actually go that extra mile for me without question. And then the rest of it is just opportunity. Opportunity presents itself for him. Then it's good. Oh, he got money. Let me let me go ahead and be around him while he got money. Oh, he, he's he's doing this. Let me be around him while he's doing this. Instead of being around me for the right reasons, like I think only two people in my lifetime. And I don't want to. I want to build a relationship that's unbreakable. Like even if we don't agree, we still love each other enough to know that I got you. Got me. We don't have to agree, but we 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 have to respect our our boundaries of hey, you're out of line. You feel me? So a lot of people, a lot of my friends are like, man, they were there with me through the last little episode, and they were like, yo, dog, I seen you like happy in your life, and I've seen you miserable in your life. And I'm gonna tell you, I won't fuck with a female who drinks ever again in my lifetime. If you drink and you want to party and that's your life, I'm not fucking with that. Ever. Ever in life. If you're one of those people who need other people's approval to make sure that you're you're, you're that, I ain't messing with you. If you're one of those people who have to down other people so you can feel like you're up, I ain't messing with you. I'm talking about even just being friendly with you. I don't want to, I don't want people like that around me because that, you'll start living that person's energy. You know what I'm saying? I don't want a female who, if her friends tell her something, she is all of a sudden in a bad mood because of what they said. I don't want that shit either. So, I'm going to make a decision in my life that's going to change the game. I promise y'all that. I'm, I, I made a decision today. Like, a lot of these motherfuckers that I, I've dealt with before in my past, like, nigga, they need to stay there. They need to stay there. Because a real person don't, don't see you, want to see you succeed. They want to see you grow. They want to see you be like, you know what? We don't have to have a lot, but the stuff that we going to get now, we can have together. That's a real, that's a real pocket. Sometimes you guys look at people... People look at me and swear I got a million dollars in a bank. They swear it. I'd be like, boy, only if you knew. But because I'm happy with who I am and I'm always cracking jokes, I'm always enjoying my life, people will look at me and be like, yo, he's always in a good spiritual mood. 
I don't got time to be miserable on somebody else's dime, dog. I'm sick of that shit. When you when you're looking at other people and they're like, all I'm saying is this. I don't care anymore. I don't care to hear the BS, man. I don't care. I don't want to be around people no more. And I make that clear to people. Like, like people like to play games. Like, I'm going to do. No. And then they want to explain who they want. Nah, it's not good enough. It's not good enough. Words hurt. Words hurt more than physical pain. You got to remember, man, like not everybody's blessed to know what it is to be loved. Everybody's not blessed for that. So when you ruin something that's nothing's wrong, man, you have to look at yourself like, what the hell was I thinking? Carter's love.